All right, are you all ready to go? Perfect. We'd best not waste any time. Unfortunately, the rain is picking up quite terribly. Uh, I didn't think it'd start raining this soon. I should have brought my umbrella. If I had, I would have offered to take you under my umbrella, but seeing as I didn't, I guess we'll have to make do with what we've got. What's that? Oh, you've got one yourself? <laughs> That's great. Here, allow me to hold it for you. Hmm? Your pajamas? Oh, no, no, no. You don't need to change into nice clothes or anything. Remember, I gotta make sure this looks real. You know? I gotta make sure it looks like I caught you unaware of my arrival. Besides, it's really late at night. It would make sense for you to have nice clothes on. Pajamas are fine. Don't worry about it. All right then. Now that everything is uh, settled, let's head on over to my boss's place. Hey there. Watch your step now, lady. I wouldn't want you to be fallen down in these dirty puddles of water. Hey. You feeling nervous? I mean, you look nervous. Well, if you are nervous in the slightest, try not to be. I'll make sure everything goes smoothly, okay? All you gotta do is just follow my lead and don't say more than you need to. So, with that out of the way, it's been a while, hasn't it? Yeah, it's been forever. I'm just happy to see that you're doing well. Or at least I think you're doing well. I mean, you look like you're doing well. Say, when was the last time we walked together in the rain like this? Wow, you actually remembered. Well, yeah, of course I remember. It was just the two of us, lost during our school's hiking trip in the pouring rain because somebody here wanted to go and catch a rabbit. It was terrible, <laughs> absolutely terrible. We actually had to make a little tent for the night using my own waterproof jacket. Not to mention, that tent, that tent was so small, we were literally pressed up against each other. And the next thing you know it, you just fell asleep on me. And because of that, I couldn't fall asleep either, since I had to be the unlucky one to hold you up, leaning on my poor shoulder. <laughs> There you go. Finally, you're smiling again. That's good. Well, I noticed you weren't fully uh, comfortable. So I just had to, you know, jog up some nicer memories. Look, I might be a bad guy. But I, uh, I know how to handle things. Alright? Besides, your eyes told me everything. Hey, remember, I've still got some of that apple juice, if you want some. It really helps me out when I get the jitters myself. So, you want some of that apple juice? <laughs> still a no? Alright then, suit yourself. But... If later down the road, you want some of that apple juice, let me know. Alright, anyways, we're almost there. It'll just be a few more minutes. Nothing too long. Hey. I'm...
just wondering about the kiss we shared earlier. I... I can't help but realize that it felt so real, our kiss. It, it felt like a kiss, a sincere one. You know, you shouldn't be kissing me like that, especially not when you've got a boyfriend. Well, yes, of course, I did enjoy it. I, I loved it, and I would have, never mind, look, what I'm trying to say is, you could get into some serious trouble if you were to find out, besides, you're happy with him, right, he's got money, he's got a beautiful home, he's got everything. And as for me, I'm just a guy scraping by with a history full of mistakes and an unpromising future. You, you shouldn't get associated with a guy like me. It's not good for you. It really isn't. You deserve better. Well, anyways... We're here now. It looks like nobody's home. Hmm. They're probably all out making deals again. I hate this life. I hate it. I should have never gotten involved. Never. Maybe... Maybe then... I could have had a... Better life. Maybe then I could have shared a happier life with you. I'm sorry. I... I didn't think I was capable of saying these sorts of stuff. I didn't know I was still capable of having feelings. I really shouldn't be opening up to you like this. Okay, so here's the room that you'll be kept in. It's, uh, it's really not all that bad. I mean, there's a bed, and I guess that's it. <laughs> I suppose it is pretty bad. Oh, I forgot to mention, if you ever need to use the bathroom, you're gonna have to Unfortunately, ask for permission. So, that sucks. <laughs> Anyways, we're both gonna have to sit tight and just wait till the boss arrives. Well, he'll be here soon, I hope. Hey, are you still feeling scared about all this? Well, tell me, is there anything I can do to make you feel better? I guess that's okay with me. I can do that. Here. It's nice. It's nice giving you hugs. I wish I could have given you more hugs back then. You're beautiful, you know. Well, you probably knew that already since I literally told you that every day when we were together. Um, listen. I'm gonna just speak my mind here. I'm in love with you. But the thing is, I don't think that I deserve you. There's no way I deserve you, not after what I've done. Yet, I want you. I want us to be together again. Is there anything? Anything?
anything I can do to win your heart again. It's selfish of me to be saying all this to you, I know. But I just love you. Wait. Hold the thought. They're back. The boss and them are back. All right, I, I need you to sit here and wait for me. I'll explain everything to him. For the meantime, please, 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 think about what I said. I love you. I'll see you soon.